Boulder, Colorado, one of the most picturesque locations in the world, let alone for college football, and you will see plenty of buffaloes roaming here. As we wind our way toward the end of another college football season, one of the grand traditions is paying tribute and respect to those who have just poured their souls into the success of this program and honor the seniors on Senior Day. As we see a squad from the Big 12, the Oklahoma State Cowboys, taking on the 23rd ranked team in the land, the Colorado Buffaloes. Buffaloes will put total leather and will get started. And they desperately wanted to attempt a return, but decided not to. Instead, they'll take the touchback. The Cowboys' offense will get the first possession of the game. And there he is. When you have a guy like this, you don't mind building your attack around the running game, guys. And he's a grown man. There's no doubt about it. This offense runs through him. Everybody gets their emotion, and everything is built on him and around him. And everybody knows this guy's going to touch the football, and still... Defenses can't stop him. He can run through tackles and make big things happen. Firing to the right complete. They're able to get him stopped just shy of the first down mark. It'll be third and short from their own 33. He'll keep it himself. Nowhere to go. And the ball's loose. Defense covering it up and not letting the offense get it back. It's a turnover. And the defense did everything right against that option play. They got to the quarterback. They forced him to keep it. Not only did they create the fumble, but they jump on it behind the line of scrimmage. That is just perfect option defense. On first down, here comes this offense. Dropping back, it's Sanders. And he'll make the grab along the sideline, but he's not able to get to the first down mark. Offense gets set for second down. He'll do it himself. And the Buffaloes get the first down. Now the offense trying to operate in the red zone. Trying to find his man on first down. He's got it and still on his feet. They get him stopped at the five-yard line, but it will be first and goal from there. The quarterback touch pass on the jet sweep. This defensive front just ran free in the backfield. He'll lose three. Defense rolls up deep in its own end on that last play. Now a second and long coming. He's looking to throw. And it'll be incomplete. This defense is physical in pass deep. This defense was put in a difficult spot, but they've made it tough, and now the offense faces third and goal. And that one is right on target if his target was the first row. They'll try to get something out of this drive and kick the field goal here on fourth down. Splits the uprights, it's good. And that'll put the first points of the game on the board. It's three to nothing. Well, this team knew coming into tonight's game, they had to get momentum early, playing at home. They want to get the crowd into it. So you get a beautiful drive here to start this thing. You would have liked to cap it off with a touchdown, but listen, you set yourself up for a field goal. You knock it through the uprights. You've got the lead. Everything right now looking good. So they're lining up to kick it off after that last drive, put a three spot on the board, and now the defense will try to shut them down. And it'll come out to the 25. No attempt at a return. Oklahoma State has it back, and the offense is on the field. One back in the backfield. He gets the carry. Not much doing there. He gets it to the 26, a gain of one. Didn't get much on first down. It's second and nine. Looking to throw. It's Bowman. Gets it out fast. He's brought down quickly. Minimal gain there. Still a bit short of the first down. Faced with a third and short from their own 32 to keep this drive alive. They'll try to pick up the first through the air. And he just throws it away on third down. I don't think you can give up on a play like that. The Cowboys will try to pin them back with the punt. He gets his first one of the day out of there. They used him three times in that loss last week. That's a perfect example of not settling for a fair catch. Pick up whatever yardage you can and help out the offense. Wasting no time throwing on this drive. 
Just a short pass to the tight end. They stop him almost immediately. Short gain there and still a little ground to cover to pick up the first. They'll keep it on the ground. He is going nowhere. Stop at the line of scrimmage. They've got it at the 41, third and short, trying to keep the chains moving. Here's the snap, looking to throw. Couldn't find a man and just had to throw it away to avoid a negative play. The Buffaloes will bring the punt team onto the field. He'll try to really get into this one. That thing was down for a while, but the big bounce carried it into the end zone, and it'll be a touchback. Oklahoma State hoping to get the pistols firing on offense. Looking for a crease, it's Gordon. That play just never had a chance. They knock him down for a loss of five. Lost five on that first play, and now it's second and 15. He's looking to throw. Got his man quickly. They make the stop, but not before he takes a chunk out of what they need to move the sticks. They'll try to move the chains on third and short from the 25. Looking for a man. It's Bowman. Unloads to the wideout. Makes the grab. He'll have enough to move the chains. It's first down at the 38. And the Cowboys come to the line with a new set of downs. Coming out on first down with the play fake. And it's incomplete. If you're going to take a hit like that, you might as well hang on to the ball. After the misfire, now on second down. He's looking to throw. Using the quick game. And that's kind of a lot of today's running game, right? Spit the ball out quick. Get it to your playmakers in space. Get positive yards. It's uh, Instead of running the ball a couple yards up the middle, now you just spit it out wide. And a lot of times, if you break a few tackles, it could be even bigger. The Cowboys will punt this one away. This will be the second time they've had to kick it away. A fairly short distance here toward the sidelines. Not his best work. And the Colorado offense is coming back onto the field. He'll come out throwing on first down. Just couldn't find an open man. He'll get rid of it, and it'll be second down. Couldn't make the connection last time. Let's see if they throw it again. Here's the handoff. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. They line up with some serious work to do if they want to convert this one. On third and long, try to convert through the air. And there was nowhere to go for this quarterback, and down he goes. Third and long situation, we're bringing an extra DB on the field, and we're telling our front guys to pin your ears back and go get the QB, and they get the job done. And the Buffaloes will punt it away on fourth down. Three and out and not much choice but to get rid of the ball. And the punt team able to sling him to the ground. Oklahoma State has it back and the offense is on the field. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. Maybe picked up a couple. He's down at the 24. Picked up two yards on that last one. They need eight on second down. Rides to the back. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. They line up, and it is a long way to the sticks from here. To the air. It's Bowman. Tight end finds a soft spot. And the defense makes the immediate tackle, but he has enough for the first down. They'll run it. Able to scrounge three yards out of that one somehow. It's second and seven. Kept it on the ground on first down. Now back to the line. He'll try it again. Really nice stop there from this senior leader. Lining up, trying to convert this third and short from the 40. From the gun, wants to pass. Quick strike complete. They'll get it to the 48. No need to measure. It's a first down. And the Cowboys are rolling down the field. They're going to run it. Not a whole lot of room there. Three yards maybe, second and seven. Got a little work done on first down. Now back to the line. Wide receiver now comes in motion. 
quickly complete. And he's tripped up, but not before picking up the first down. And there you see the bind that the RPO play can put a defender in. That linebacker had to make a decision. Was the running back going to get the ball? He thought so, so he bit up, and that allowed the slant to be thrown in behind him. The offense has it first and 10 from the 42. Wide receiver coming across in motion. Holds and fires complete to the right. Love the decision making by the quarterback there on the RPO play. Defense took everything away deep down in the field, so just check it down, get it to your guy in the right flat, and let him go get you. On the ground, it's Gordon. <clears throat> Tackle is made, but not until he gets the first down. And the offense about to dial up its 10th play of this drive. Wants to throw on first down off the play fake. Can't find his man as he took a shot trying to deliver that football, and it'll be second down. To the air, it's Bowman. Right on target this time. Really nice job there by both guys to throw and the catch to work that defense and get the first down. From the red zone, looking for a space. Makes the grab. They'll get him stopped just short of the end zone, but they're in business here with a first down. He wants to throw it again. Coming after him. Took a shot as he threw. Hit hard just as he released it on first down and just couldn't get it to the receiver. They'll try to slam it in. And he takes it to the house. Touchdown, Oklahoma State. Precision blocking up front created the open lane and the running back followed it beautifully. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty easy to follow an offensive line that makes those holes and just gives you a caravan all the way to the end zone. What an unbelievable job blocking up front. Lining up to tack one more onto that lead. And the extra point makes it 7-3. to three. They held the ball for 15 plays on that touchdown drive and close the deal with a three-yard touchdown run. He'll bring it out from inside his own 10. Nice job executing all of the assignments as they put a stop to that return at the 22. Colorado has the ball back, and the Buffaloes hoping to put their team in prime position on offense. Gets it out quickly. It's early in the game, and as offenses try to get their rhythm, these easy completions are very important because that's what helps you get your feet underneath you as an offense and as a unit. And hopefully, as this game goes on, they'll be able to rev up and get more aggressive taking shots. Somebody needs to make a play here. It's third and long from the 26. Fires complete on the crosser. They'll keep this drive moving by picking up the first down. They have it at the 36. spot in the middle and they'll finally get him down after a terrific pickup and the buffaloes will have it first and ten he's gonna pass throws toward the end zone falls in complete and he did everything perfectly except catch the football second down coming he had it and he dropped it almost one of those big plays he's known for it'll be third down to the air it's Sanders they'll run the screen they play that screen nicely he tried to find his way to the marker but it'll be fourth down guys that's the end of the quarter and Oklahoma State has the lead here and we've come to the end of the first as we take a moment to check out the stats so far They've swapped ends of the field, and we're ready to go in the second. The Buffaloes will call on their punt team. He's going to try to flip the field with this one. 
And the punt hits ground at the two and goes into the end zone. He just missed. Pinning them right in the shadow of the goalpost. It'll come out to the 20. With the catch, it's Presley. And a good job in coverage there as they stop it after just a few. That last completion sets him up on second down. He's looking to throw. Fires to the wideout. Catch in the middle. It's Presley. And he almost ran away from everybody on that one. A huge pickup on that play. Wow, and a nice job working the middle of the field. I think it's so important to keep defenses honest. And you can't just dink and dunk outside. you got to work the middle. Great job finding this wide receiver on the middle of the field. Looking for space. It's Gordon. He's knocked down in the backfield. He'll lose a couple. Let's see what they've got on second down. From the gun, they'll try to impose their running game. Creating some space, getting just enough good blocking, and they've got it up to the 47-yard line. Third down conversions are a huge stat, and this one would be a doozy if they can pull it off. He's right on target. They've got it inside the 40 at the 39 as they pick up the first down. It is so good for an offense early in the game to get in a rhythm and to start stringing first downs together. It makes the game really easy and puts that defense in a situation where they're starting to get tired. They want to sub. They want to get other guys in the field. Stringing first downs together like this makes it hard to defend. The Cowboys are moving quickly down the field. The pull and throw off the RPO. Put it right on him. Sweet play. Good pick up, and they'll move the change with the first down. And how many first downs is that, guys? On this drive alone, this defense has got to find a way to get off the field. They're playing way too many snaps. Now on the move at the 28-yard line on first down. Looking to move it through the air. Fires toward the end zone. And it's caught! Pistols firing! Touchdown, Cowboys! And you want these guys that can take the top off a of defense. It changes the way they're going to play coverage on you, and he does it right here. Just runs by the DB. He had no chance to try to catch up with him. Makes the big play down the field. And this will change the way you play defense against this guy the rest of the game. Ready to try the point after. And the extra point will tack another one onto this lead. They march 79 yards on the drive. And the score comes on a touchdown pass covering 28 yards. Let's see if he can make a play on the return. He was looking for some running room, but not much to be found as he stopped at the 18. And the Colorado offense is coming back onto the field. Trying to start the drive with a pass. Grabbed behind the line, it's Hunter. And just a short, safe pass play. They pick up a few. A little bit more to go after that last completion. They'll try to pick it up on second down. Finds his tight end. And he was able to shed a tackle and pick up the first down before they finally get him on the ground. These routes have some reads and adaptability built in, and the big fella found that cushion and made the play. Man, it's so awesome how much offenses have evolved. They know exactly what they're getting, where to sit down, quarterback, tight end, on the same page, gets the first down. And the Buffaloes come to the line in the hurry up. Pulls and fires it complete to the right. He's close to the first down, but they're going to mark him just a little short. They want to just keep throwing it. And a missed opportunity on third down as the defense knocks it free, and fourth down is coming up. Signals for the fair catch, and that's where they'll put it in play, just outside the 20. Oklahoma State hoping to get the pistols firing on offense. Looking for space, it's Gordon. 
tripped up at the 25 after picking up four. After the productive first down play, it's second and six. Gets it out fast. They make the stop, trying to pick up just a little bit at a time to get to that first down marker. They'll try to move the chains on the ground. And works it to the 40-yard line. That'll be a first down. And the Cowboys come to the line with a fresh set of downs. They're going to go right back to him on first down. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. Lost one on that last one. It's second and 11. Looking to throw. It's Bowman. Got his man quickly. The defense wouldn't let him loose, and even though it's a completion, they lost yardage. A third and long coming up here. He's looking downfield to throw. Getting some heat. And the pressure gets to him. Down goes the quarterback. On third and long, you know what's coming. That's exactly where you want to get an offense. The passing game has to come out. You go nickel, bring some more speed on the field, and the defensive line gets home and gets the sack to force the fourth down. The Cowboys decide to punt it away. On the return, it's Hunter. He only needs a sliver of daylight. Can they catch him? He will score! Touchdown, Colorado! You're down. You need a play. What a nice job on the big punt return to give a spark. You can hear this home crowd going bananas. They needed a big shot in the arm, and they got it with the punt return. attempt to try and with the extra point they cut the lead to 14 10 and you just can't put a price on having a guy like that back there to return punts and he turned that one into a touchdown from inside his own 10 let's see what he gets really disciplined job by the coverage unit to get down there and make the stop at the 19 Hold and fire complete. Finally run out of bounds, but he has this offense rolling with a first down. And the Cowboys want to pick up the tempo. Man, this quarterback is having himself a day. Over 200 yards in the first half. It was hard enough for Palmer to get over 200 in a game, more or less in the first half. They'll line up for a second down play. They'll go right back to him. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. I'm not positive, but that first down marker might be in the next county. To the ground with the back. He's dropped behind the line of scrimmage. That'll be a loss of three. The Cowboys send out the punt unit. Let's see if he can help the coverage team out with this one. On the move, it's Hunter. He's brought down, but a really solid effort to pick up every bit of yardage he could on the punt return. Colorado has the ball back, and the Buffaloes hoping to put their team in prime position on offense. Oh, he drops the football. He had him right down the gut of the field. Instead, it'll be second down. To throw, it's Sanders. This time, it's complete. He's brought down quickly. Minimal gain there, still a bit short of the first down. They'll snap it from the gun on third down. Using the quick game. He's got first down yardage across the 50. They'll mark it at the 49. The inside handoff. And offenses want to continue to feature the run. They want balance. Even if it's not super successful, you can take it a little bit at a time just to keep that defense honest. On second down, wants to throw. Grabs it inside the 15. Ripped off a huge chunk play on that one as he gets the first down before he steps out of bounds. Oh. 
caught in the backfield. It's Hunter. That completion gets them inside the 10, and the defense is running out of room to defend. Second down coming up on this red zone opportunity. He's looking to throw. Takes the easy one to the back. The defense wouldn't let him loose there, and it was a completion, but they lost yardage. After that last one, they're staring at a second and long first down marker just short of the goal line. It's a draw. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. And they'll send the field goal team back out for the second time tonight. Never a doubt. So after the last drive ended with a field goal, the kickoff team out there to send it away. From inside his own 10, he'll try to help out their field position. And the returner will be knocked down. Oklahoma State has it back and the offense is on the field. Pulls and fires complete. They make the stop after the catch and still some work to do to pick up that first down. Now on second down and short. Gonna run it. It's Gordon. We've seen a ton of this tonight. They just keep giving him the ball, and he keeps running into brick walls. Not much running room again. They'll try to drive ahead on third and short. They bring him down, and he's gonna lose a yard on that one. And the Cowboys will line up to punt it away. They've been busy out there to punt for the fifth time today. Looking for a block, it's Hunter. Coverage team gets the job done and they'll mark him down at the 38-yard line. They've got a little time here to put together a productive drive late in the half. Quickly complete. He's run out of bounds, but not before. Turning in a big pickup and moving the sticks for a first down. He's looking to throw it. Quick completion on the out. And he'll step out of bounds after a very productive play. This offense has a second down play. And it'll be incomplete. This is some physical pass defense. This feels like four down territory, third and short from the 40. Fires to the big fella. He's out of bounds, but not before picking up enough for the first down. And the Buffaloes come to the line with a new set of downs. Wants to throw. It's Sanders. And that ball is picked off. He was thinking big return. Didn't get that. But boy, did he give his offense an opportunity at the 31. And that's just excellent coverage. Man, cover one, nowhere to throw the football. Look at everybody playing man across the board. And you still got the safety in the middle of the field. Nobody open. And if I'm the QB man, I don't need to force it. I don't force it into tight windows if it's not there. He throws it, unfortunately, gets the interception. Bad decision by the QB there. Oklahoma State hoping to get the pistols firing on offense. Looking to go up top on first down. Finds his man. It's Owens. They make the stop right there. Good pickup. It's still short of the first down. So much for jumbo sets. They'll go five wide on second and two. Stopped at the 44 after a five-yard gain. Now they'll line it up from the 44 on first and ten. He wants to throw. Unloads to the wideout. Oh, did he find a hole in the defense? He'll be brought down at the three-yard line. An explosive play in the passing game as him on the doorstep. Well, after that last play, you can see how electrifying this guy is and how special he is after he makes the catch. If I'm on offense, I'm trying to find a lot of ways to get him touches in this game. The Cowboys line it up with a first and goal. They'll immediately call timeout. They've really got this offense humming. Just the fourth play of the drive, and it's first and goal. They'll go to the air. Pulls it in in the end zone. Touchdown, Cowboys! 
And I just love the execution by this offense. Late in the half, man, you want to take the lead. You want to get that momentum on your side, and they do it. They finish it with the passing game. And I'll tell you what, heat that passing game up. You can keep this lead, keep the momentum, and keep putting up numbers. They'll try to tack one more on their score. The kick is up and good and put one more on the lead. Quick work on that scoring drive, just four plays. And they finish it up with a three-yard scoring toss. And he'll just take a knee, and this drive will start at the 25. And the Colorado offense is coming back onto the field. He wants to start this drive with a pass. Got his man downfield. He's loose down the left side. Touchdown, Bucks! And once he got loose, it was all over. And I tell you what, that passing touchdown, man, that should spark this whole team. Like, the comeback is more than on now. Like, they got the touchdown. They cut into the lead. You, you want to get a stop and go into the half, get all the juices, all the excitement. And, you know, listen, the passing game's rolling. We got this. The comeback's in full effect. The AT unit on the field. Smashes it through for the PAT. That kind of drive will boost your confidence. One play, hit the big pass, put a touchdown on the board. From inside the 10, here he comes. Didn't find any crease in that kickoff coverage, and he'll be stopped at the 17. Oklahoma State has it back, and the offense is on the field. They'll throw it on first down. Can't hang on, and he'll tell you he really should have made that catch, and he had an opportunity right in the middle. It'll be second down. Back to throw. It's Bowman. Quick strike complete. I like the slot receiver because he gives his quarterback a good option working the middle of the field. He's a nice weapon in this offense. On third and long, trying to have a big completion here. He'll be brought down, and that's the final play of the half. First half in the books. Time now to join Kevin Connors in our halftime update. Fellas, Yeoman's work so far today in Boulder. And welcome in to the halftime update. The passing game for both sides has been outstanding. On point, unrelenting. They've excelled in the short game, the intermediate game, and especially on the deep ball. All in all, a thrilling display of offensive firepower, and these defenses have a lot to discuss here at halftime. With that said, let's send it back to the fellas at Folsom Field. And the Cowboys will kick it off to start the second half. From inside the 10-yard line, he'll bring it back. Just never had a chance to shake loose, and he'll be brought down at the 24. Colorado has the ball back, and the Buffaloes hoping to put their team in prime position on offense. Feeling some heat. Couldn't find anybody to throw to. He'll just toss it away. It'll be second down. Couldn't make the connection last time. Let's see if they throw it again. On second down, just keeps firing. Zings it complete to the right. They stop him almost immediately. Short gain there and still a little ground to cover to pick up the first. Takes it from the gun on third down. Quickly complete. And he's brought down at the 40-yard line, and that'll be a first down. The Buffaloes come to the line with a fresh set of downs. Movement here from the tight end. The give to the back. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. Lost one on that last one. It's second and 11. The RPO, it's complete. And a good job of coverage by that defense. Just a short pickup. Wow, this offense is just stuck in the mud. They've already punted four times, and it's third down now. A strike downfield. And he was on his way. Gets it all the way to the 38. To the air on first down. Throws to the wideout. Makes a connection. 
Makes the grab and knock down, and he's got it at the 25-yard line. Grabbed in the backfield. It's Horn. And oh, did they know that one was coming. They'll knock him down in the backfield. Now the play fake. Got his man on the right. He almost picked up the first down on that one, but he'll be just a little bit short. Here on third down, you might want to protect the field goal, but you have to stay aggressive. To the ground to try to pick up the first. And they make the stop just short of the line to gain. Inches to go. It'll be fourth down. Less than a yard to go for a first down, and the offense will remain on the field. On fourth down, trying to find his man. Receiver looks it in. It's complete. Let me tell you, this senior quarterback can flat fit it in a tight window. Going for six. Touchdown, Buffalo! And with that one, they jump on top here in the second half. And it's now the second time this wide receiver has scored another outstanding job with the route. Great job securing the catch. Now the two-point conversion attempt is coming. Back to pass, it's Sanders. And he makes the grab for the deuce. They put it in the end zone with a 12-play scoring drive. And they cap things off with a nine-yard touchdown pass. On the run from inside his own five. He was looking for some running room, but not much to be found as he stopped at the 18. Oklahoma State hoping to get the pistols firing on offense. From the gun, running back gets to give. He'll be stopped just short of the 20 at the 19. Give him one. The Cowboys will hustle to the line. Fast motion from the offense. He's looking for a man on second down. Makes the grab. It's Presley. He's really close to that first down marker, but they stop him just a bit short. They'll try to move the chains on third and short from the 27. They'll try to get it through the air. On target. And he'll be taken down, but he does have enough for the first down. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. Well, we know this guy is special. And because of that, his quarterback is looking to him on critical down and distances. There on that third down, there was no question. It wouldn't have mattered if he was single covered, double covered, man zone. That's where he was going with it. And the big time playmaker outside picks up the first. Now staring at a third and short from the 40. From the gun, wants to pass. Gets it out quickly. And they reacted well to the completion, but it was too late to keep them from getting the first down. These two guys, just on the same wavelength, they make clutch connections all the time. And that's practice, man. That's all summer. That's all spring. Just so many hundreds and hundreds and thousands of balls where you know exactly when that guy's going to break. You know he's a stud. You're going to feed him, especially on these third down situations. And he doesn't find much running room. A short gain on the play. On third and short, they'll go to the power running game. He's dropped behind the line of scrimmage. That'll be a loss of three. And the Cowboys will send out the punt unit. Here's the punt, and whether it goes three yards or 93 yards, just don't let that return guy get it again. And the Colorado offense is coming back onto the field. Pulled and finds his man on the left. At the 45 on his way. And he'll be forced out of bounds, but not before. Yet another big play in this passing attack. One big play and you go from a little backed up to threatening. It's first and 10 from the 40. Quarterback can't pull the trigger and down he goes at the 41. And that is your job. The O-line has to protect their quarterback. That's the most important position on the field. You got to make sure you keep him upright. You got to do a better job.
That offense having to deal with the last thing you want on first down, giving up a sack as they come up to the line on second down. Dropping back, it's Sanders. It's complete to the right. He was running through tackles and picked up the first down and finally got knocked down. Comes out throwing on first down. And he just threw that one away. Safe move, didn't see anything, lived to play another play. Didn't connect last time. Let's see if they throw it again on second down. Makes the grab on the left. And he was able to run through one tackle, but still only a modest gain. Looking to throw it again. Gets it out fast. And he's not going to get there. The defense stands tall and makes the stop. And they'll run the field goal unit back out there. This kicker has already banged a couple through. What a disappointment. No good. And the margin remains at seven after the miss. Oklahoma State has it back, and the offense is on the field. They reached deep in the playbook, used almost all of them, it seemed, Jesse, and still ended up having to punt last time. And I think on this next drive, David, you can go back to some of the stuff that worked that last drive, too. Find the things that you had success with. You just got to be able to build on it a little bit. Yeah, and just break that extra tackle, you know? Make that extra play. Make the guy miss. Put a drive together so you can finish with some points. The run game just has not been working for this offense all game long. We saw it on that last play as well. Just not getting enough push up front on the offensive line. They haven't been physical. That's what you expect from a senior. Don't give them any extra yards. Great tackle there. Some third down conversions tougher than others. This one, a long one on third down from the 43. Can't make the play on the interception, and man, they were looking for their first pick of the game. Instead, it'll be fourth down. Fair catch, called for and made. Colorado has the ball back, and the Buffaloes hoping to put their team in prime position on offense. Fires and picked off. And after the interception and the turnover, this defense has set its offense up for business. Tell you what, when you come out of your own end zone, you know, in the shadow of your own end zone, a lot of bad things can happen. You want to kind of get a few first downs, get some space. So if you punt after that point, you can pin them a little bit deep. This is the exact opposite of what happened. Now you set them up in beautiful scoring field position already. Really bad play by the offense. Looking for a man. It's Bowman. Let's it go to the end zone. It falls incomplete. He was trying to find his man for six. Going to work in the red zone. They can't pick up the first down without getting it into the end zone. This time on target. Gets it inside the five. Down to the four. And it'll be first and goal. New set of downs right on the doorstep for this offense. They'll try to get it in with the run. They've got it down to the three. Now it's second and goal. Tries again to get it in. He steps and powers and works his way. They finally get him down at the two. They love to make this short field pay off with a touchdown instead of a field goal, but it's third and goal. Just hammer it with this running back again, and he noses his way into the end zone. Wow, this offense. They have a lot of faith in this running back. Knowing if they get down in this area of the field, he can get it done, and he can answer the bell. Two rushing touchdowns already for this offense. Lining up for the PAT. And after that extra point, we have a tie ball game in the third quarter. And we're all square as he's set to kick it away. Here's the return from inside his tent. 
Not a lot of space to be found. Good hustle by the coverage team, and they stop him at the 21. And the Colorado offense is coming back onto the field. Fired that thing out in a heartbeat, but it's incomplete. Man, what a finish we could have. Tie game, third quarter here, second and ten. Misfired on the last play. They'll go back to the air. And the Heat will get home, and the quarterback goes down at the 17. Whoa, that linebacker sacked that quarterback, and he was on him quicker than a hiccup. Yeah, and you see quarterbacks back there pointing and telling the offensive line who to block, and, well, it didn't work, okay? He was not prepared for that. He comes scot-free, and the quarterback pays the consequences for that one. Not exactly the ideal situation for this offense. Third and long, backed up inside their 20. On target over the middle. And he was loose and in the open field and on his way. A tremendous pickup on that one. He leaves it with the back. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. Lost one on that last one. It's second and 11. Dropping back, it's Sanders. Fires to the wideout. Pulls it in. Makes the stop at the 49, but not before he gets in plus territory. Gets 15 and a first down. Got his man quickly. They stop him just a link or two short of the first. And man, what they can do on second down here. Using the quick game. Good job running that route to get past the sticks because he got nothing after the catch. The aerial assault continues. Quick strike complete. And they'll finally catch up to him, but not before a big chunk of yardage is picked up. How nice is it as a quarterback when you don't have to throw post routes to get great stats? No, I can just throw it quickly to one of the fastest players in the entire nation and let him burn this defense. He bullies his way all the way down to the five-yard line. Second and goal for the offense. Wide receiver shows motion. Wants to throw on second down. And it'll be intercepted in the end zone. In situations like this, it's nighttime, it's so cold, it's so hard to complete these types of passes. And for these wideouts, it's going to be tough just catching the football because that thing, I guarantee you, feels like a rock. Ready to fire from the pistol. Leaves it with the running back. On the move at the 30. And he's got enough for a first down. Now to see if they have enough time to snap it again here in the third. They fought tooth and nail through three, and it is all locked up as we take a look at the stats. They'll start the drive here with first down to open this period. Right back to the well. The big defensive tackles in the middle, they're not always the best pass rushers, but they are strong, and I say country strong. They put their hands on you, you feel it. They lock people out on the line of scrimmage. They create separation. They wrap running backs up, and usually they don't get out of the midst of those big boys. The deep thinking brings some heat on third and long from the 44. Grab behind the line. It's Presley. And he's not going to make it. The defense denying him the first down. The Cowboys line up to punt it away. The punt is headed out of bounds, and they couldn't be happier about that, given the danger of that return guy. Colorado has the ball back, and the Buffaloes hoping to put their team in prime position on offense. Fires left. And he got a hand in there, knocks it away incomplete. After they couldn't connect, it's second and ten. They'll run it out of the shotgun. Still on his feet at the 45. And the big game, and they've got it on the 46. And the Buffaloes are in the hurry up. 
and he finally breaks one. They get rewarded. They've been trying to run the football, Palmer, but just haven't had success all day. Yeah, and the staff never gave up on him, too, right? They kept giving him opportunities, and maybe that's the run that starts to open things up here later in this game for this guy. Back to throw. It's Sanders. Unloads to the wideout. Got a man in the middle. Nice pitch and catch there, and they'll have enough for the first down. And the Buffaloes are moving quickly down the field. Off the play fake on first down to throw. Just gets rid of the football. Nobody to throw it to. It'll be second down. Couldn't make the connection last time. Let's see if they throw it again. Quarterback on the keeper. A solid pickup there before the defense is able to make the stop. The Buffaloes have moved it inside the 20. In the gun, looking to throw on third down. And that's incomplete. A defender all over him. Knocked the ball to the ground. Fourth down coming up. So here we are on fourth down, and this field goal kicker is going to face all the pressure in the world. He splits the uprights and puts three on the board. And now they regain the lead. All field goals are not created equal, guys. Kicks in the fourth quarter to take the lead. They just seem to carry so much more weight. So give that young man credit for getting out there and knocking that thing through the uprights. With all the pressure, with all the eyeballs on him, he delivered. So after the made field goal, they'll kick it away and rely on their defense. Looking for an alley from inside his own 10. And good work by the coverage team to get the return man down on the ground. Oklahoma State hoping to get the pistols firing on offense. From the shotgun, the handoff to the back. That's about as close as you can get to that marker, and it will be second and just a few breaths away from the first down. He's piled up 82 yards on the ground, and he has his eyes fixed on leading the nation in rushing. He steps out of bounds, but it will be enough for a first down. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. Using his legs, it's Gordon. And a really nice run and pick up there before the defense avoided disaster and stopped the really big play. Off play action on first down. Fires to the tight end. And he'll step across the sidelines after making a good gain on that one. Second down coming up. Making sure they have good balance, keeping it on the ground. He's knocked down in the backfield. He'll lose a couple. They'll try to move the chains on this third and long from the 50. Looking downfield, it's Bowman. He finds his man. He couldn't find anywhere to go, and now it's fourth down. And the Cowboys will try to pin them back with the punt. He'll try to really get into this one. And the punt hits ground at the two and goes into the end zone. He just missed, pinning them right in the shadow of the goalpost. It'll come out to the 20. And the catch along the sideline will come up a little short of the first down. Here comes the offense on second down. The play action fake. Hit as he throws. Got it in the middle. It's Horn. And he's knocked down immediately, but not before he moves the chains. Off the play fake on first down to throw. They're bringing heat. And the defense gets to the quarterback. I think if you're the head coach here, it's a bit of a mixed reaction to your passing attack so far in this game. You put up a bunch of yards throwing the football. You've lit up the scoreboard, but you've also given up four sacks. Pass protection has been a problem so far in this game. That's the last thing you want as an offense, a negative play, a sack on first down. Looking to throw on second down. Quickly to the tight end. They bring him down, but a solid pickup to put them in position to pick up a first down. If they can convert here, that type of play can really give you a shot of momentum. Pocket starts to collapse. Forced to just throw it away on third down, and now they face fourth. And the Buffaloes will bring the punt team onto the field. They may have to pay him overtime. He's punting for the fifth time today. 
They'll get down and put a stop to this return. They'll mark it at the 32. Oklahoma State has it back, and the offense is on the field. They'll leave it with him. At the 45 on his way. He showed it all there. A little elusiveness, a little power, and he's got the first down. Might as well run him until they stop him. He's got it again. And how about that interior defense stuffing the run for nothing? Back to throw. It's Bowman. Out of the backfield, he's open. He knew exactly where he wanted to go with that one, and they've got enough for the first down. The Cowboys come to the line with a new set of downs. Off the play fake on first down. It's caught downfield. That is exactly what you're looking for when you talk explosive plays. The defense finally able to make the stop. Power football with the run. Got some room, headed to the goal line. Touchdown, Cowboys! They move on top here in the fourth. And this offense really showing their physicality, running the football when it matters in the fourth quarter, in crunch time, to take the lead in this football game. They'll try to add another to their lead. And the extra point is good, and every point counts. It's now a four-point lead in the fourth. Lining up to cover the kick after that touchdown drive. The returner will field it and try to do some business. And the coverage team able to make the tackle. And the Colorado offense is coming back onto the field. From the gun, the running back tries to hit the hole. Not much there. They'll give him one to the 14. Didn't get much on first down. It's second and nine. It'll be a draw. Now they've got breathing room. Got six all the way out to the 20. A third and short coming from their own 20-yard line. From the gun, wants to pass. Throws to the tight end. He makes the catch. He'll have enough for the first down, and they stop him at the 45. And that's why quarterbacks take their offensive lines out for all-you-can-eat wings. Clean pocket, able to step up, scan the entire field, and pick the open receiver. They'll throw it on first down. He's got it inside the 25. Touchdown, Colorado! They've got the lead here in the fourth. I think one of the most underrated things we talk about with the QB is timing. Being able to get the ball out of his hands to his receiver where he can continue to catch the football and run with it. Nice pitch, nice catch, nice play in the fourth quarter when you needed it for this team to take the lead. If he can make this one, the lead will be three. And it's good, and he pushes the lead to three. Quick work on that scoring drive, just four plays. And the score coming on the touchdown pass from 55 yards out. And he takes this from inside the five. He was hoping for something a little more dynamic, but they get him on the ground at the 20. Oklahoma State hoping to get the pistols firing on offense. On the ground, it's Gordon. Into the pile, maybe got one. He stopped at the 21. Didn't get much on first down. It's second and nine. He's looking to throw. And he fires over the middle. It's incomplete. They couldn't connect on second down. Now staring at a third and nine. Looking to throw. It's Bowman. Throws to the wideout. Another incompletion on third down. And the Cowboys will punt this one away. They'll look to pin him deep. Makes a move. Coverage team able to put a stop to that return at the 42-yard line. So we'll see the offense on the field to start this drive. He wastes no time and comes out throwing. 
He's got it inside the 30. Touchdown, Bucks! And once he found daylight, it was Katie bar the door, baby. He has been surgical. Precision passes. Using the scaffold, the fine instrument, rather than the blunt one. And the defense has had absolutely no answer for it. Just has been it down their throats all game long, a step ahead, understanding what he's seeing, and just destroying this defense. He'll try to tack on one more. And the extra point extends the lead to double figures at 10. That's the kind of drive everybody loves. So see quarterback one snap, put it in the end zone. From inside the 15, here comes the return. Couldn't find a way to create that broken field as he stopped at the 25. Oklahoma State has it back and the offense is on the field. Wants to throw on first down. Catch in the middle, it's Presley. Makes a catch and knock down. The Cowboys headed quickly to the line. Good start to this drive, and they'll need much, much more if they're going to give them a finish. They need a ton more of this, but you've got to start the drives great. The first play needs to be really good. That was a good start. Now we've got to keep building on it, and we've got to do it in a hurry. They'll line up right at the 48-yard line on first and 10. Well, down two possessions. Good news is you get the completion. Bad news, though, did not get out of bounds. You know right now, saving the clock. That is at a premium for this offense. And he almost ran away from everybody on that one. A huge pickup on that play. QB now has over 400 yards passing, guys, and you got to give everybody else in his supporting cast a ton of credit. Receivers, great job running routes, catching the football, and this offensive line has been outstanding, giving him time to throw. Makes a grab, and he's dragged down. Now here on second down, see if they keep tossing it around. Well, you've seen the last two plays now. This guy's versatility, and you've seen why he might be playing on Sundays in the not-too-distant future. This guy can catch the ball. He's a big part of their passing game, and he's a weapon, and a guy this defense has got to be ready for. They keep attacking through the air. Snagged in the middle. It's Gordon. And they wrap him up, but not before he gets enough on the catch for the first down. From the red zone, he's going to throw it. Unloads to the right. Makes the catch. And he will score. Touchdown, Oklahoma State. Well, how about that? And after that touchdown, we might have a finish after all, Jesse. I love it, Reese. And this team is not quitting. Yeah, they're down on the scoreboard right now, but they are clawing and they are scratching their way back in this game. They're going to keep going hard until this clock reads all zeros. Lining up to add another. And it's up and good as they draw just a touch closer. About to kick it away after scoring the touchdown. And it'll come out to the 25. No attempt at a return. First down here with time for maybe one more play until the two-minute warning. They'll keep it on the ground. The clock is on their side. We've reached a two-minute warning in this offense, trying to milk this clock and keep time on their side. Going with the counter play here. Banging, slithering, whatever it takes to get that ball up to the 32. Calling a timeout here, you have to avoid making a mistake in this situation. They'll go to the air on third and short. Throws for the tight end. Right on the money to the outside. He dragged the toe. And how about the ball placement? Only the receiver could get it. The give to the back. Ripping through the defense. He'll work his way down to the 28. Defense uses a timeout quickly, trying to get that ball back and preserve time for their offense. And the Buffaloes have it with a first and 10. To the ground. He's got it again. He's dropped behind the line of scrimmage. That'll be a loss of three. 
Quick timeout called by the defense, stopping the clock to save as much time as possible for their offense. They'll give it to the back. They bring him down, and he's going to lose a yard on that one. Now facing a third and long. Running back searching for a hole. And sure, tackling there to keep him from getting to the first down marker. So on fourth down, here comes the field goal kicker in a huge spot. And he missed it. No good. Guys, a missed opportunity there. The lead is still three. And look, I know there's not a lot of time left, David, but that's a big miss. Obviously, if he hits it and forces the other team to need to score a touchdown to win, now he's left the door just a bit open here. And we've seen crazy things happen in college football. Yeah, and, and crazy things need to happen because you still got to make a few plays to get down the field with very little time on the clock. But now there is hope. You've got a chance. And the other kicker on the other sideline better be getting warmed up. A beautifully placed ball to the outside and the toe drag for the big pickup. And the Cowboys in the hurry up. He spikes it, clock stops as they try to rally late. Offense gets set for second down. Looking for a man, it's Bowman. Fires deep toward the end zone. And it's incomplete, and the final drive of the game comes up empty. You want to talk about building confidence, coming through with clutch plays, making the winning plays at the right time can really set the course for the rest of the season. Yeah, Reese, maturity and experience matters. And this team has guys that have played a lot of snaps. They've seen a lot of looks, and they've lost close games like this in the past. That wasn't the case today, David. Too many guys out there making big-time plays. And I think belief is what you build. That confidence, you know you're going to win. You don't think you're going to win. You know you're going to make that play in the big moment and continue to build on week-to-week -week success. And you look up and you're like, dang, we strung a couple wins together.